Jeff Brazier has he's chosen his two sons to be best men at his wedding to Katie Dwyer this year. Freddie, 13, and Bobby, 14, were said to be honoured when their dad asked them to take on the prestigious role. They are so excited and have already been working on their speeches, Jeff told The Mirror. It's going to be the most emotional moment I've ever experienced, he added. It will be a recognition of everything we've been through and how strong we are now. His sons were just four and five years old when mum Jade Goody passed away from cervical cancer in 2009. Jeff, 38, said it felt surreal to now to call himself dad to two teenage boys. Their childhood is flashing before my eyes. I'm having to teach them things like how to cook and use the dishwasher, he joked. And on life as a single parent Jeff said, I don't see it as tougher, you just have to be more organized. It can be like a military option. Jeff also the reason Freddie had decided to spend Christmas with his grandmother instead of his dad and brother. On Christmas Day the dad stunned fans when he tweeted to say the usually tight-knit family were part for the holidays for the first time ever after Freddie insisted he be with his grandmother rather than his dad and big brother Bobby. Revealing it was Jade Goody's mum he went to see, Jeff said Freddie had insisted she couldn't spend the day alone. Freddie asked me a week before Christmas and I gave him some time to decide. Freddy is very big-hearted he didn't want his grandma to be on her own so it was the two of them together, explained Jeff. Despite missing his youngest son, the proud dad said, what matters far more to me is that this young boy can express concern in such a way. It was really beautiful of him and I could see it meant the universe to his gran. And if Jade was watching then it would have given her immense satisfaction to see too, he added. Jeff also spoke about the special way they celebrate Christmas so the boys don't feel too upset about their loss. It's the most obvious day in the calendar when Jade's not there. Of course we notice it every day, but in order to make Christmas better we've learnt that a visit to Jade's grace first thing in the morning helps. After putting her first the boys can enjoy the rest of the day, explained Jeff. Jeff also told how he and the boys keep Jade's memory alive by talking about her often as well as looking back through old photos, magazine clippings and reality TV footage. It's the best way to remember her special mannerisms, claimed the dead. Following Jade's tragic death from cervical cancer in 2009, young women became inspired by her bravery and openness to attend smear test appointments in record numbers. However, earlier this month it was reported that the so-called Jade Goody effect had become a thing of the past, as cervical cancer testing hit a 20-year low. It does make me sad, said Jeff about the statistics. But it's people's own choice at the end of the day. Jeff is still doing all he can to raise awareness of cancer testing, recently taking part in ITV show The Real Full Monty alongside Harry Judd and Mark Forster. The TV star also said he's still on a high after proposing to girlfriend Kate Dwyer last year, who Jeff describes as a wonderful female role model for his boys revealing they are going full steam ahead with wedding plans, Jeff said, she's massively into the organizing. She's just taken it and run with it. Certain aspects she's much better at than me and she's much more organized. She does everything with passion, he added. As Katie plans their upcoming nuptials, Jeff said that his boys keep him busy with football and boxing classes, as he estimates he spends over 200 hours a month driving them. Jeff Brazier has partnered with Vauxhall Motors to explore how long parents spend driving their kids around. 
four.